Hello oh, and welcome back to Free to Play Friday. Um, today I will be doing Five Nights at Freddy's Ultimate Custom Night. Um, so if by some chance you haven't heard of this already, um, Five Nights at Freddy's uh, um, Ultimate Custom Night is basically fit. You get you have 50 characters that can all be turned up to 20. Still up 20. You can't add any more than 20. Um, and that challenge is known as 5020. They all have their unique um, uh, mechanics. Um, like Funtime Foxy here, he has his own like little um, thing where you have to check the curtain to find out when his show is uh, set to begin. Then be sure to watch his uh, cam at the exact time to postpone the show. Otherwise, uh, that is uh, when your game will end. Um, and then you have annoying one, that, that's fairly annoying, but um, there's other ones like Night to Marionette, uh, Marion, which it doesn't let, don't let your mouse uh, kiss uh, Lingo over Night Marion for too long. And he, and he can be a little bit hard to see sometimes. Um, but that has some Easter eggs, like um, Old Man Consequences here. Use a C button uh, to catch fish when uh, the mini game appears. Otherwise, he will uh, um, lock your uh, monitor for a short time. So, uh, yeah, yeah, if I remember correctly, it should be an Easter egg here. So, um, that's the controls. Um, I was, I did practice a little bit for this, but not too much because I um, had other things to do. I wanted to do, and I just sort of never I ended up doing too much practice. Just gonna wait for old man consequences here, because he's the only one that's turned on right now. Oh, and you see, ready over here, you can bump the nose. And yeah, and you move that because that's um but it's not fun time cheeky, it's um Rockstar Cheekiest mechanic. Reset ventilation. And yeah, so the these areas are full of little Easter eggs. So you have um, Candy Cadet from um, Pizzeria Simulator over there. You have um, the Freddy from Five Nights at Freddy's Free. You have Ennard's Mask. There we go. Oh, here we go. Springtrap, um, I think his name's William Afton, I keep on getting William and Michael mixed up, so I think William Afton off the top of my head, I'm not going to look at it, anyway, um, Springtrap, um, he is a child murderer and he killed all of the children whose souls went on to possess the animatronics, creating Five Nights at Freddy's 1, 2, 3, 4, and 4, essentially, um, and there's a, a few other bits, watch the game first, he explains it a lot better than me, um, but he hasn't covered this yet, and this is, uh, it's a bit hard to make out when you speak, but it's, it's definitely him, and he's saying something like, Henry, I hate, or oh, maybe asking for hell, um, or oh, maybe he's going, I hate Henry, because Henry, you know, tricked him into, um, going uh, to the, um, fat, uh, Freddy P3 simulator place where he eventually burned and went to hell. So a lot of people, there's a theory that a lot of people um, support that says um, we are playing as Springtrap, uh, Michael Afton or maybe William Afton, um, 
trapped in a purgatory state of hell. Um, kept here by Golden Freddy, or whoever the one he should not have killed was. Um, and this is Golden Freddy. Yeah, the game crashed. Um, I'll be back with you in a minute when I finish explaining this. But well, and that's it. There is Golden Freddy going into the water, ending the game. That's why it just crashed because you know he uh, set them free. He Golden Freddy is now at rest. I'll be back when I put the when I get the game back up because that crashed. And I'm back. Um, so yeah. Um, you you know a lot of different officers. So there's the one we saw. There's another one uh, that's based around the, um, the pizzeria simulator. There's one that's based around Fe Freddy 3. All that could be sister location, I don't know. Um, and there's one based around the Death Angus of Freddy's 4, but it requires you to get a high score of 2,000, 5,000, and 8,000 to unlock them. Um, and I've only got a high score of 700. Yeah, I'm not that good at this game. Um, yeah, so just a demo. Well, I'm tempted to just like have one game of all of them on 20 just to show you how bad I am but that's not really much to say because nobody, not many people can actually do 50-20 mode. Um, there's also challenges, so there's bears attack, 1, 2 and 3. Um, there's pay attention, 1 and 2. Which, so let's go with these fit. Uh, for Bears Attack, you have Freddy, Toy Freddy, uh, Golden Freddy, Phantom Freddy, Rockstar Freddy, Ned Bear, Helpy, Molten Freddy, and the Lefty. For Pay Attention, we have BBJJ, Funtime Foxy, Nightmare BB, Marionette, Helpy, Music Man, Funtime Chica, and William Afton, Afton himself. Well, just Afton, and then you have Springtrap. They're the same person, I don't know why he bothered naming them differently. And then we have Ladies' Night, which is Chica Toy Chica, Mangle, JJ, Wither Chica, Jacko Chica, Nightmare Mangle, Circus Baby, but Ballora, Funtime Foxy, which is a bit odd around Funtime Foxy, because in the, uh, you get, when you, at every 700 points you unlock a uh, little cutscene, and in them they suggest that, um, Funtime Foxy is a boy, because, um, Toy Chica, when, uh, wanted uh, to be with him forever, and described the Funtime Foxy as a him, so, uh, again, Foxy's, uh, um, questionable, um, gender is at play here. Happy Frog, Rockstar Chica, Funtime Chica, and the, the Scrap Baby. Then we have Creepy Crawlies, which is Mangle again. We have uh, Withered Chica, we have Withered Bonnie, we have Marionette, we have uh, Springtrap, we have Phantom Mangle, we have Ennard, we have uh, Happy Frog, Mr. Hippo, Pick a Patch, Ned Bear, or Orville Elephant, Music Man, Molten Freddy, and Afton. We have Nightmares Attack, which is one of the most curious ones I've seen, because yeah, we have the obvious Nightmare Freddy, Nightmare Bonnie, Nightmare Fred Bear, Nightmare himself, Jacko Chica, Nightmare, Man Nightmare Mangle, Nightmare Net and the Nightmare Baby, but we also have uh, Withered Bonnie and Golden Freddy, and uh, the Molten Freddy and the Scrap Baby, and uh, the Lefty. Which of those last ones, uh, you know, these three and these two, are the most curious in my opinion, like, Nightmare. Like, okay, I could get Bonnie because, um, if you didn't know, Bonnie, when they're making Go Five Nights at Freddy's, Two, I believe, um, Scott Cawthon, the creator of these games, had a nightmare about Bonnie trying to get him, and, his, uh, and it, um, it was like a waking nightmare, so he just sat at his door, you know, all night, but Golden Freddy, 
That's a bit curious. Also, uh, Molten Freddy's Crab Baby. Like, I guess you could sort of see that because Molten Freddy's like all torn up and yeah, he is. Uh, if you saw that in real life, you'd shit yourself. And the Crab Baby does have that giant claw, so they are in their own way some scary. Well, yeah, we also have Music Man, which is also curious, and Lefty. Which, again, is just curious. And then we have Spring Trap, where we have um, JJ for some reason. We have Spring Trap, Phantom Mangle, Phantom Freddy, Phantom BB, all from Five Nights at Freddy's 3. For some reason, we also have the Trash Gang and the De A Afton, which is Spring Trap, so that makes sense. And we have Rockstar Foxy on 20. Fun fact about Rockstar Fo Foxy while I'm here. Um, turning his level up does not increase the amount of times he will jump scare you, but actually the amount of times his power will appear for you to click on him. So whether he's on uh, zero, 0 or 20, he has the same chances of jump scaring you. We also have old friends, where of course it's all the Five Nights at Freddy's 1 and 2 characters, apart from JJ. Uh, we have Springtrap and the Circus Baby, and of course Phone Guy. Which makes sense um, with it all because, um, you know, we faced these guys in the first two games and um, Circus Baby was, well, if we're playing as William Afton, she was our daughter. If we're playing as Michael Afton, she was our sister. As if I'm getting the names correct. And then Phone Guy was in Final Fantasy Freddy's 1. And then we have Chaos, which is Bonnie, Foxy, Toy Bonnie, Toy Chica, Mangle, BBJJ, yeah, Withered Chica, Withered Bonnie, Phantom Mangle, Phantom BB, Nightmare, Night, Night, Night Marion, Nightmare BB, Old Man Consequences, Ennard, Trash Gang, Helpy, Happy Frog, Mr. Hippo, Pig Patch, Ned Bear, Orville Elephant, Rockstar Freddy, Rockstar Bonnie, Rockstar Chica, Rockstar Foxy, Music Man, L Chip, Funtime Chica, Lefty, and the Phone Guy. So yeah, you can also create your own custom challenges like um, Five Nights at Freddy's 1. I like have all of the characters that appeared in Five Nights at Freddy's 1. So it would be you guys, it would be Golden Freddy. Even though there's FNAF 2 Golden Freddy, he was in FNAF 1 and Phone Guy. Or you uh, could uh, do Five Nights at Freddy 3. And if you want to just like do that, then you can just like um, add. Oh no, no, no I just want ah. to. I just look silly now, I thought I would uh, just add one on. Yeah, so it would add one on to. Oh yeah, I don't know why I just thought it would only add one on to those. There, yeah, Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Um, that is a little bit lackluster, so you could probably like put Phone Guy in there as well because he did appear and add a couple um, other characters. And of course, there's Knack 2. We have Toy Bon, Freddy, Bonnie, Chica, Mangle, BB, JJ, River Chica. Withered Bonnie, uh, Marionette, Golden Freddy, and uh, uh, no, no, Freddy. yeah, that's all of them. And then you could, yeah, and again, you could just like do that with FNAF 3, which would be all of these. Uh, not FNAF 3, FNAF 4. Then uh, you have. Um, uh, what is it called? Um, they say a race RPG that Scott made that I can't remember the name of. FNAF World, yeah, FNAF World. Then you have Sister Location that you could do. And then you have uh, um, the Pizzeria Gang, which it would probably be the most difficult because um, you have all of these guys. Going on right now. Because all of these, one way or another, appeared 
and Five Nights at Freddy's Pizzeria Simulator. So this would probably be the hardest out of any of the challenges. Well, apart, well, no, you wouldn't see L tip. That would be um, along with that. You, you you would put them in with all my consequences um, for um, FNAF World because he did appear in FNAF World. Um, also here we have um, show char character info. So if I turn that off, it doesn't show the information. And then we have visual effects, and if you turn that off, that will minimize lag, which is very helpful if you're going for 50/20 mode. Um, yeah, uh, I'll have one or two games of this. Uh, but something I will say is that this, um, this is not made uh, for scaring you. This is made to be a challenge. Um, so let me see. Uh, yeah, fast coin. Talk system. Use the auto layer. Yeah. Auto layer. Yeah. I can deal with you. You two are not, not bad. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Right. I spent too long in the camp while he was at the door. Yeah, so that just goes to show you how bad of this game I am. Because they were only on 10. That's e uh, the easy mode. 20 is hard. It's like the hardest mode. So I'm guessing that's like easy or normal mode. Um, so yeah. Um, something you saw there was... Um, Sometimes when you get jump scared, they will have voice lines, um, and these are the reasons why we know we know that uh, um, we're here because of the person that he should not have killed. Because uh, in the, some of the voice lines, they will uh, say, um, will reference the you know he you should not have killed, and uh, um, I think even like um, nightmare or. Um, Nightmare Fredbear even said, uh, or maybe it was Night, uh, Nightmare Fred. Anyway, Dorka did a video on this. Go watch his video. But um, it was like, I am. Uh, I was like brought here, brought to life, but not by you, but by the one you should not have killed. And um, with the uh, with these guys, the ones that. Uh, um, the me mediocre melodies, um, they will even have um, unique voice lines that rarely appear when you get jump scared. And then in the background, there's another voice. Now, a lot of people will say that it sounds like Baby, but it could just be the same voice actress, but to a different in-universe character. And uh, um, it, it was just like, I'm gonna keep you here, you know, and I think um, even all the elephant, elephant was like, he tried to free you, he tried to free us, but I will keep you here, no matter how many times he bends us forever, and it is just like, really cool, because originally it was gonna be like, uh, this is non-canon, but it, yeah, he made it kind of like, I guess, before this game even came out, like any teasers were shown, it's like, this is gonna have a, you know, as, you know, scrap this law, thread it in with it, if it's non-canon. But now it's completely canon, which I would not have guessed, um, to be honest. So, uh, that's it for this video, I hope to see you guys in the next video, bye bye.